items into groups, it becomes easier to work with. Let me show you what I mean. If I wanted to count all of these straws, it would take a long time to do it one by one. But if I use my knowledge of grouping, I can count them much faster. Let's practice. We know that these three groups are in bundles of 10. That means we can count by tens. We have 10, 20, 30. We have 30 straws, which is in the tens place. Now let's count the remaining straws in the ones place. One, two, three, four, five, six. What does 30 plus six equal? If you said 36, you are correct. Let's try another. Let's count 85 straws. To do this, we first need to get the tens column. Which number is in the tens column? Right, it is 80. How many bundles of 10 do we need to get 80? If you said eight, then you are correct. We need eight groups of 10 to get 80. Now on to the ones column. We need five ones or five single straws. One, two, three, four, five. Now we have 85 straws and we did that very quickly. Good job. We have eight groups of 10 